Good evening, everybody. We're preparing a drink tonight. It's called Moroccan Night. It's a play on words, K-N-I-G-H-T, Moroccan Night. This is from one of our favorite restaurants in California. It's called Press. It's in the town of St. Helena in the Napa Valley. And they had Moroccan Night on the menu five, six years ago. We went out to visit. It was delicious, got the recipe, and have not made it till now, end of 2020. So requires a couple of ingredients. This one's a little bit more complex, but still approachable. Anybody can do this at home. This here is saffron infused vodka. So you gotta make this two, three days in advance. What you do is take some vodka, a few threads of saffron, not too much, you're gonna overwhelm it, and leave it in for two, three days. Here's our Hangar One Buddha's Hand. Uh, great, one of, the, one of the great vodkas, Hangar One. This is a uh, rare flavor. Uh, I shouldn't say rare, but you can't find it in every liquor store. So call around, go on Hangar One's website and figure out where to get yourself some Buddha's Hand. Buddha's Hand's a fruit that looks like a hand, if anybody isn't familiar with it. This also has some lemon juice in the recipe. Uh, preserved lemon, you gotta make this two, three weeks in advance. So I'm, I didn't, I'm not gonna preserve a lemon, but if you're gonna do it, that's the right way to do it. Need two, three weeks. I had this idea two days ago. Uh, so we're gonna use some preserved lemon. This is from Taste Encounter, awesome restaurant in Somerville outside of Boston. They make their own. And then we've got Raz El Hanouk. This is a Moroccan spice in Arabic. It literally means top of the shelf. There is no true Raz El Hanout recipe. Uh, everybody has one and it's a great blend of spices. So this is gonna go in some spice bags with a one to one sugar water ratio. And we're gonna make our simple syrup from Raz El Hanout. With any simple syrup, you're gonna have your ratio of sugar and water. I'm gonna use one cup of water and a little bit less than a cup of sugar. So my wife's happy and drinks more. Um, here's the Raz El Hanout. So whatever you're putting into the into the simple syrup. Uh, I'm gonna use a spice bag. This is good for bouquet garnies. Uh, good for this purpose. I'll just tie this tight and throw it into the pot. So we're gonna boil the water, sugar, and Raz El Hanout mixture. We're just gonna do the sugar and the water first, let it come to a boil with the sugar fully dissolved. And then we're gonna add the Raz El Hanout spice bag to make the simple syrup. Always use a frozen glass or a, or a chilled glass. All right, so we've got our chilled glass. First thing we're gonna do is take the preserved lemon and muddle it with the simple syrup in a glass. Ice in. We're looking at one ounce of the Hanger One Buddha's Hand, one ounce of the saffron infused vodka, 0.75 lemon juice, and 0.75 of the simple syrup was already in there. That Raza Hamid simple. That's it. Press when she was bartending or bar manager there, 2014, 2015, gave us this recipe. It's the first time making. Most of the recipes we're going to share with you guys are tried and tested, but this one's the first. Cheers. Mm. 